Well, we've been hearing a lot lately about Russian nuclear drills, but also it appears NATO might want to pick a fight with Russia, but shockingly, they don't seem to have a plan if that fight includes nuclear weapons. Now imagine this, Russia led by Vladimir Putin is flexing its nuclear muscles, running drills and making veil threats. And NATO, well, they seem to be a bit caught off guard. According to reports, there's actually no solid plan on how to respond if Russia decides to turn those veiled threats into a nuclear reality. That's right, no plan. Now, the geopolitical analyst, at least this is one individual, but Arena Tuskerman has given us a glimpse, a glimpse into what might be going on behind the scenes. And there might be some measures to stop Russia before it can launch an all-out nuclear attack, but it's a bit murky. It's like knowing that there's a storm coming, but not bothering to board up the windows. And you have to ask, what are they thinking? And let's talk about who's really at risk. That's countries, of course, like Poland and Moldova and the Baltic states, right in the danger zone. And of course, they've been scrambling to upgrade their defenses, but those upgrades not quite ready yet. And that leaves them and potentially incredibly vulnerable. It's a high stakes game of nuclear chicken. Right now, it seems NATO's strategy is hoping the other side blinks first. And just when you thought it couldn't get more tense, Belarus is sending troops to the Polish border. They've been doing military drills as well, all for a standoff with NATO. And with battalions at full operational readiness, as President Lushenko says, it's clear that this isn't just a routine maneuver. This is a statement that's making the situation even more volatile. And then, of course, it seems like NATO seems to be gearing up for a confrontation they really aren't fully prepared for. And one has to wonder, what's the plan? Or is there even one? Of course, we'll keep our eyes on here at TNS. What are your thoughts? I'm sure you got a few of them. Leave your comments down below. And, of course, share our reports for TNS. Texas News Studio, Mark Myers. We'll see you soon. Talk to you soon at the next report. See you then.